Hey guys, it's Friday. I'm Brittany. This is Seven Awesome Lesbians. Um, uh, this week I chose a topic, and it's uh, how do you deal with those awkward situations that come about uh, during like the holidays when family gets together, specifically family that like doesn't know. And I'm asking this because like I'm sort of getting together with family this Christmas, and like a lot of them like they know, but I haven't told them. Like, my other family members have told them, and it, so there's going to be, like, this awkward, like, elephant in the room. And, uh, my plan is to just sort of, um, not acknowledge it. Uh, I mean, like, if you want to, go for it. Like, just be like, so I have a girlfriend, and, like, you can tell everybody you want to. But if you just want to, like, you know, enjoy your time and not have to worry about it, just, like, you know, keep it simple, small talk, um... Uh, ask them a lot of questions instead of like leaving open space for them to ask you questions um and if they do ask you questions like oh so i hear you have a girlfriend just be like yep i'm really happy and then move on or something like that basically just sort of like um beating them to the punch i guess that's why i'm planning on dealing with it um the second part of the question is uh your favorite poem and i first heard this poem in the movie Patch Adams, and I'm going to read it to you. It's Sonnet 17 by Pablo Neruda. Um, I do not love you as if you were salt rose or topaz, or the arrow of carnations the fire shoots off. <clears throat> um, I love you as certain dark things are to be loved, in secret, between shadow and the soul. I love you as the plant that never blooms, but carries in itself the light of hidden flowers. Thanks to your love, a certain solid fragrance, risen from the earth, lives darkly in my body. I love you without knowing how, or when, or from where. I love you simply, without problems or pride. I love you in this way, because I do not know any way, any other way of loving but this, in which there is no I nor you, which there is no I nor you, <laughs> so intimate that your hand upon my ch chest in my hand so intimate that when I fall asleep, it is your eyes that close. A story that was really brutal. I'm not very good at reading poetry like Sarah and Alana are. Or, and bleh, it just makes me like stutter and sound like an idiot. But regardless, that's my favorite poem. Um, I don't know, something about it is just like really potent and like it just, it's, it's a really beautiful poem and I love it. Um, I also love anything written by Andrew Gibson. <laughs> I have, like, a secret obsession with her. So, yeah. Go check her out. Sorry this is a short video, guys, but, um, sort of got a lot of stuff to do. Um, take care. Peace. Um, I will see you guys next Friday. And, um, let's see here. Uh, next Friday will be... The night before the night before Christmas Eve, which is kind of cool. <laughs> so, uh, anyways, have a good night, guys. Love you all. Copious amounts.